Hello guys, I'm Yelchin. Today we are going to discuss the review analysis tool from Seller Sprite. It's an amazing tool. You can see every detail of your competitors' reviews. Let's begin. If you add products into your review analysis, you can see them here. Another easy way is to go back to Amazon. Search for any keyword like bamboo pillow. Find your most relevant competitors. For example, this one. Open it. When we come to the product detail page, you can see a pop-up here. Generate AI analysis report or generate seller sprite analysis report. They are the same thing. You can click any of them. Then we need to wait a little bit. When ready, click view it now. We are going to see product information, variation, price, etc. Here we are going to see reviews and review related metrics. For example, this particular ASIN has more than 2,300 ratings. This ASIN has more than 1,700 ratings. This ASIN has only 16 ratings. Here we are going to see average ratings of 3.3 and 3.5. We are going to see reviews and review amounts here. This ASIN has 230 reviews and this ASIN has 270 reviews. We are going to see the ratio and sellers. There are four sellers under this product and five sellers under this ASIN, as you see. Then we can see the launch date here. If you would like to send all these data sets over to someone, you can just click here, share, copy to our clipboard and you can send it to your friend or someone else. For example, I'm opening incognito mode and paste it. Then click enter. Here we see that data as well. So there's no problem if your friend or colleague didn't buy our software. You can generate this report and send a link as they will be able to open it without any problem. If you would like to download it, you can click here and download it as a PDF. Or if you would like to update it, you can click here and update it. As you see, I already downloaded it as a PDF. You can click and see keep a data set here. Here is the first data set from AI Shulex. As you see, 40% of the reviewers are male and 60% are female. Next is the questions. For example, who? As you see, self represents 60%, spouse account for 10%, and 5% of reviewers are mentioned about a parent or someone like that. This is the majority of mention. Next is when, for example, they mention at night, during sleep, and during a nap. You can see the ratio here. And where. For example, reviews have been mentioned about a bedroom 18 times. Someone used it in the living room, etc. You can see this question and the question ratio. And next, usage scenario. For example, you're going to see the topic here, percent you're going to see here, and here is the reason. For example, sleeping. 57.53% mention sleeping, and there are the reasons. Helps sleep better, great for problem sleepers, used for sleeping at night or something like that. We can see it by clicking here. Or for example, watching TV. 5.47% mentioned watching TV. Some users use the pillow for watching TV in bed or something like that. It might give you a hint where these people use pillows while sleeping, traveling, reading, sleeping position, etc. Just close it. Next is customer experience. 24% of reviewers mention firmness. 9.45% of people mention lack of support. What did they say? Users reported that the pillow lacked form, shape, and support, and was too soft. This is the most probable downside of the review. Let's close it. And the next is pros. What do people like about pillows? Let's open and see it. Comfort, durability, value for money, etc. More than 14% of people mentioned durability. It holds up well over time, does not get flat, 
it still looks and feels brand new after a month of use. This is the positive side. Next is breathability. For example, more than 5.6% of reviewers mentioned breathability. It does not get too hot during use, for example. Let's close it. And now we are going to check cons. For example, lack of support. More than 23% of reviewers mention lack of support. What they said. Some users find the pillow flat, lacking form or shape, and too soft, without enough support. Or flatness. More than 13% of the reviewers mentioned that the pillow is reported to be totally flat, not even and flattens out too quickly over time. If you would like to launch a pillow on Amazon, you need to consider all of these cons and improve this problem to get a better product on Amazon. Now let's close it. Here we are going to see purchase motivations. What motivates people to purchase our product? The topics, comfort, good value, durability, would recommend, and good for allergies, motivate the customer to purchase this product. Next we are going to see the rating ratio here. As we see, the average rating is 4.3. More than 2,800 ratings are 5 stars, and its ratio is 68.5%, 1 star reviews unit 268 and its ratio is 6.5%. This is another function from Amazon feature. Customer's value for money is 3.6. Sleep quality is 2.4. You can check these metrics and improve if you are going to launch a new product. Here we are going to see a rating by star and its ratio. For example, in the last three months this Assassin got three reviews and its ratio is 18.8%. If you would like to see a 12-month rating, you can click it. You're going to see reviews, ratings and their ratio. Here we're going to see the rating by type. For example, Review with picture is 20 units. You are going to see it from the red color here. Review with video is only 3. The general review is 485. There are no Vine reviews for this product. If there is, you are going to see it here. If you would like to see only this one, you can click it from here and see it as well from this pie chart. Let's go down ratings by variant. This product got a majority of the reviews as 62%. This one got 37.5% reviews in the last three months. If you would like to change the time frame, you can change it from here. And you're going to see a different ratio and different bar charts here. If you would like to change all ASIN to size for variations, you can click it from here and change it as well. For example, this is the first variation, these are the second and the third. Here we are going to see the first variation and this variation got over the time reviews. For example, it got three reviews in November 2021. In September this ASIN only got one review. We can change to see the next variation review by clicking here. This variation only got one review in September 2022. Two reviews and one review in March and February, respectively. Let's go down. These are the keywords that have been used most for reviews, like bamboo pillows 19 times, or 3.7%, love these pillows 10 times, or 1.9%. If you would like to copy these keywords, you can click here and copy all of them. We can sort reviews for stars. For example, I would like to sort and bring me to one star review, selected, and filtered now. We are going to see all the one star reviews here, or if you would like to see reviews with bamboo only, you can put the keyword here, and click it. You're only going to see the reviews with bamboo or whatever keyword you would like to put, just put it here. And if you would like to see four star reviews, just click here, and filter now. Next is reviews by type. For example, I would like to see reviews with pictures. Just select it and click now. We are going to see all those reviews here and one another metric. 
If you would like to see reviews with pictures and two stars, just select it and click. Now we're gonna see two star reviews with pictures. Now let's check another review. View all models. For example, I would like to see reviews for only this variation. Just select it and filter now. We are going to bring all the reviews, just this product and this Asin got. Again, if you would like to filter, just select from here Vine Reviews. I select picture and click. Then you are going to see why reviews for this particular variation. Of course, you can see these metrics for descending or helpful descending etc. And if you would like to see reviews for different time frames, for example, the past month, the past three months, or last week or if you would like to customize, you can customize it from here. For example, I would like to see reviews in May 2019. Just select it here. Unclick this one. And select all variations. Click filter now. As you see, there are only two reviews in January 2019. Guys, this is a very powerful tool. You need to analyze your competitors and your competitors' reviews of what problems they have. Then you can develop it for you. You can improve and remove that problem and you can get a better product. If you would like to download all these metrics, you can click here and download as Excel to send or to check later. This is a detailed view of the review analysis. I'm sure it can give you a lot of information about your competitors' reviews. After analyzing these review-related metrics, you will know your competitors very well and you'll know what needs to be improved. Thank you for watching. See you in the next videos.